right, just on another brick at work. This one's Decision by Ease. This is from the ninth game. Um, totally love the gameplay of it. And in love with all the music. And so I figured to make an easy guitar lesson on it just because um, I fell in love with video game music when I was young and I spent tinkering, um, playing stuff by ear. And this is one of the easier ones, but hey, why not? I figure someone could really appreciate this. All right. So this has some great stuff for beginners. We're going to play in 13th position. We're not going to leave that position. So 13 will always be your first finger. 14 will always be your second finger. 15 will be third. And 16 will be fourth. This will only change, but we'll never leave that um, 13th position for the last two notes. Like that. Um, so we'll talk about that later. Another reason is this will be dealing with hinges. You're going to see how our first finger or our third finger is going to go ahead and double up jobs. So right here, the beginning we have... So in three separate occasions, I go ahead and do a hinge technique. We're going to start on the B string. We're doing 14, 16, 13 of 1, then 15 of 3, 16, 14, 13. But watch. I already have my first finger flat. Why? Because I'm going to do a 13 of my third string. A lot of beginners will go... It's a... So we have... Next part is we have 13 again, but then we do 16, 15 of our fourth string. And then we're going to flatten that third finger as a hinge technique to do 15 of our third string. And then we're going to do it one more time coming up because we're going to do the second string. We're going to do 13, 14, 16. 13 of 1 and 13 of 2. So we have this whole... the whole first section. The second line that you saw in the video is going to be very similar to the first one. The only difference is we're going to start on the 13th fret of our third string. So we have 13, 14, 16 of 2, 13 of 1, and then 15 of 3. 16, 14, 13, with the prepping of going to 13 of the third string. The only way it's different now is we're going to do 16, 14, 13 of our first string. So this is the second line. Hinge. Following this, you'll do the top line again. But then you're going to do something different. So I kind of lied, you'll go to 11th position. So let's talk about the fourth line that I showed in the video. We're going to do 13 of 3, 14, 16 of 2, 13 of 1. Except instead of going down to 15 like we have usually, we're going to chill there. Then we're going to do the 18th fret, then the 16th fret, then the 13th fret. Go to the 11th position, play that 11, and then 13. This is my terrible handwriting. You can go ahead and take a screenshot because I'm going to go ahead and say it's the top line, second line. And guess what? You play a top line where it says top line again. <laughs> and then you finish with the bottom line. <laughs> 